What are four things you should be looking for when recommending loaded struts for a vehicle? We're gonna find out next. This video is sponsored by Auto Value and Bumper to Bumper. Visit us online for more information. Loaded struts are a great option for your customers to return their suspension system to like new operating condition. What things should you be looking for before you recommend a loaded strut for a vehicle? Well, number one, measure the ride height. You need to check the service information under the alignment section to find the correct specifications and how to measure the ride height of the vehicle. This will reveal if the vehicle is at the correct ride height and if it's within tolerances left to right and front to rear. Number two, visual inspection. Look at the struts, look on both sides. You may see something like this, or it could be as subtle as on the bump stops, it has bottomed out a few too many times. This is a sign the springs might be weak. Number three, look at the mileage on the vehicle. Today, a vehicle with 130,000 miles on it, well, it's just broken in. But the ride control components, the shocks, the struts, the springs have gone through billions of cycles as it's gone over bumps, tar strips, and other things in the road. This causes wear to the dampening elements and also the springs themselves. So recommending new ride control can help restore the vehicle to like new condition. Number four, always go for a test drive. With ride control components, they degrade slowly. So the customer's not gonna notice because they drive the vehicle every day. You are a fresh person in that seat and you could tell if it's diving too much during braking or shifting too much under cornering. So go for that test drive. To test out the ride control, you don't have to go faster than 35 miles an hour to get an idea what's wrong with the ride control. So when you're recommending loaded shocks and struts, follow these four tips and you'll be more successful with your sales. I'm Andrew Markell, thank you very much.